Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a new character for you guys. This is the juggler from Cirque du Soleil's Barakai. Barakai! Barakai! Uh, this show is retired, but I'm glad I got to see it before it, you know, retired. Uh, I got to see the arena version of it, not the big top version, unfortunately. But it was still good, so. Um, yeah, this is what I came up with. So if you guys want to see how I created this look, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, follow me on social media, and give this video a thumbs up. So without further ado, if you guys want to see how I created this look, then just keep on watching. Alrighty guys, welcome back to my video. Let's get right into it. So the first thing I did is went ahead and prepped my face. I primed my face using a aftershave balm. Can you believe that? Next thing I did, I took the Ben Nye White Foundation and I applied it on the highest point of my face and just the eye area and the chin and the nose, halfway on the bridge of the nose. We're going to create kind of like a half V, as you'll see. And the nose is not fully covered because we're going to blend foundation and the white, giving you that little mid-color, a uh, little ombre gradient look, like so. And I went ahead and took this up uh, Ben the foundation foundation and I brushed it all over my face kind of blending those two the white and the foundation just a little bit together just to make it a little look, look a little smoother next I took this Ben Nye cream pencil in blue and I went ahead and outlined my eyebrows and kind of brought it down the bridge of my nose like so creating like a little contour Next, I filled it in, and obviously you're going to do this on both sides, and once you have both sides completed, you're going to take that same pencil, and underneath your eye, you're going to create your new waterline by doing like so, and then from the point of where you ended uh, the stroke on the nose, you'll bring it in to that waterline, kind of creating like a little V-shape. Next, I took this red um, cream pencil from Ben Nye, and I filled in my lips. Next, I went ahead and created two little dots, my little contour, and I used that to kind of snatch my my little contour. We, got, we, we drew two lines to make it our, our new contour, if that makes sense. No, it does not make sense, Jesus. And then blend it in a little bit with the sponge to make it look a little more natural make it look like it's blending into the skin next I took yellow uh, cream color and I brought it in the bones of my cheeks the apples of my cheeks sort of ish Next thing we're going to do is going to set our face with a little bit of powder. Uh, be sure to get rid of those crease lines on all over your face because you do not want crease lines all over your face. So be sure to get rid of them and then set your whole face with powder. And once you have that completed, go ahead and brush off any excess powder you might have left over on your face and brush it off. I took Electric Eel from MAC Cosmetics uh, eyeshadow and I applied it on the brows as well as underneath that new little waterline we created, yes squad. <coughs> it looks so beautiful. Oh. Next I took uh, In the Shadows I believe and kind of used it as uh, same but to give it more depth in the blue and then I took a little bit of Mac yellow eyeshadow and I applied it on the yellow parts that I created on the cheek area took a little bit of lime green to make it look like the yellow is kind of blended into the blue next I took fire red a blush from Ben Nye and I used it on the red part of the face, of course. 
just to intensify the colors and make them pop. As well as the lips too. And next on a small pointed brush, I took a little bit of a Marine Ultra MAC acrylic paint and I applied it underneath the the blue that we created just to give it even more depth into it as well as the eyebrows too. So I also filled in the eyebrows with that same acrylic blue. And then using a little brush, kind of buff it out to, you know, blend it in, make it look a little bit more natural. Next, I took the Cloud White uh, Ben Nye Magic Cake and I placed it all over the eye part. Make sure to eat, also get underneath the eye as well. And once you have that done on both sides, I used a little bit of Ben Nye Luxe Powder and Ice and I went ahead and covered the white part just to kind of intensify even more the white and on the yellow part I applied a little bit of Aztec gold and I applied more ice of the shimmer powder on the white parts just to give it that nice pearly white look to it apply a little bit of mascara to both of the eyes set it with a little bit of setting spray and you are finished 